Saturday, September 30. We're over here at Stony Hollow Pond in Plano. There's a view of the uh, pond. It comes round and makes sort of like a little L maybe or a, yeah, about an L shape. I uh, fished it here uh, a while back and got a few. We'll see what happens this morning. All right, wish us luck. All right, uh, let's work our way down here to the bank. Hopefully we don't scare any snakes or anything. It's kind of chilly. It's in the uh, 60s right now, or correction, 70s. All right, got one. Kind of chased it and took it. It's putting up a good fight. Not sure if we'll be able to get them to the shore here, but a lot of brush, but we'll see what we can do. All right, let's see if we can get them up close. A lot of brush here. There we go. All right, not a bad looking one. All right, not bad. First fish of the day. Looks like maybe, oh, 14, maybe 14 inches. All right, uh, one thing that's tough about uh, Stony Hollow is uh, they have this buffer zone and you have to deal with all this brush that's along the, uh, uh, along the, along the bank. And so you have to uh, make some adjustments and with a fly rod you usually get tangled up but you can also see where some folks have made some paths so that's probably a good idea is to go stop and try those spots so they've been cleared out already and maybe there's a, a good spot uh, to fish from there okay uh move down just a few yards from uh where we caught that one and we're just going to work our way here see if we can get another one to strike there's a hit all right that one hit it on the drop as we we're pulling on it see the line kind of twitch looks like the other one or a very similar size as the other one all right fish number two fish number two not as big as the other one but uh, definitely a nice one cool beans okay we got uh, two now both on the damsel fly there's another one not sure what it is yet little bass little bass all right one took it on the drop like the other one. All right. Little guys want to play today, too. Cool beans. Kind of tough getting it out there. We got to deal with this brush here, but we can work with it. Try some long pulls. There we go. Oh, yeah. This one's taking line. All right, long pull this time. I think we're gonna have to put him on the on the reel. Let's get him on the reel. See, he's putting out some line. There we go. Okay, not bad on a little four weight. Come on, buddy. Come on. Got a little bend in it. Let's see if we can uh, hook up with this guy. Okay, come on. Let's get a look at you before we lose ya. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, baby, yeah. Come on. There we go. There he is. All right. Just trying not to horse since it's a little four weight. Not bad looking. Bigger than some of the ones we've been catching lately, so let's see if we can make sure we don't lose them. They say. Excellente. You're right. Cool beans. Number number four. Okay, um, this was uh, bass number four. We're just going to do a quick guess. So we've got it at the bottom of the uh, reel or rod, and it comes up just, just past the pursuit right here. So pursuit. All right, and we'll measure that out and see what happens later. All right, here's one. up a good bend in the rod let's see there we go almost there so oh yeah it's not bad I think he's like the other ones uh, maybe just like the other size so all right cool uh, we're gonna try this one spot and then we're gonna call it quits <clears throat> this is right at the bend 
And all we'll do is just kind of work it for a little bit and see if we get a couple of bites or maybe a bite or two. All right, got that one. That one kind of hesitated as we were bringing it in. There we go. What happens is this is a deeper section. It kind of dips. We saw it when it was uh, drought conditions. So there's like a little dip here and a lip that runs all along there. And uh, bass tend to like uh, going there. I think all these guys are about the same size. They all come up. Well, this one's just short of that pursuit uh, label, about an inch shorter. So, oh well, not bad. All right, uh, we're gonna call it quits. Fullweight did really well out here at uh, Stody Hollow. That uh, damselfly did uh, all the work today. Kind of beat up, but bottom line, that was the uh, go-to uh, fly for today. All right, so next time we'll catch y'all later. Good luck and good fishing.